I breastfed and nursed my kid until he was four years old. And I have a tip for you if you're looking to stop nursing. Like if you have nursing an older kid who is doing extended breastfeeding to two, three, four years old, and you're like, I need to stop, I got you. Also, if you think this is gross, just swipe, go away. We don't need to hear. Anyways, um, I thought he would stop nursing around three because that's when my other child stopped nursing. But then I remembered that child got sick and that's why he stopped. But it was okay that he's still nursing because I was really wanted it to be like on his terms and not forced by society because actually the average age of weaning in the world is between four and six, depending what you read. But he was going strong. I did set like limits, like only at nighttime, not during the day, not during the morning, etc. But he like was obsessed and he calls it boob milk. But um, I looked in those books because I was just done. Around three and a half, I was done. He's not four and a half and we just recently stopped almost four and a half. But I looked into those books and I was like, I just don't feel like good about this. So I got that like, it's called Sucker Buster. I'll show you. I got it right off Amazon. It's like 20 bucks, not sponsored in any way, shape or form. Um, but it's like that stuff you put on your nails. If you bite your na nails and you want to stop biting your nails. But I actually got this in January and did not use it yet because I was like feeling bad and guilty. And so many people are going to comment below. You should have just told them to stop. Your advice is needed. Got it. So we talked about for a long time that eventually when he gets older, the milk will taste bad. And because that's what happened to my other son, actually, around like two and a half, one side, he said tasted like throw up. I think it was salty. I don't know. But um, maybe that was around three. But we talked about when you get older and you don't need milk anymore, it will taste bad. And so the other like a uh, week ago, I decided like I can't. I'm just, uh, as much as I wanted to do this, like a really like thing where we're a unit and we're doing this together and I'm not going to feed into society. I was just done. So it smells horrific. And I put it on and he asked to nurse and I let him nurse and he nursed for like five seconds. So I was a little nervous and he goes, "Ugh, that's spicy. And I said, oh no, does it taste that? He goes, yeah. And I was like, oh, I guess you're old enough now that it's not, you don't need it anymore. And he's like, oh, okay. And so for the next two days, he just like asked to cuddle and have me rub his back. And then he asked the nurse again. And I said, yes, put it on a whore. And he's like, oh, it's still spicy. I don't need that anymore. And then he did ask again this morning and I said, huh? He goes, oh yeah, I just get huggies now. And there was no tears and there was no sadness. And we talked about it. I felt like he could understand like, oh, this is going to happen. Like eventually I'm not going to have mom's milk anymore. I'm excited. I do feel sad, honestly, because it's special. Like it's a special thing that only moms who extended the breastfeed will understand. And now when he gives me huggies or snuggles, he says, I love you. You're a good mom. And I wonder if like that when he's nursing, he's saying, I love you. You're a good mom. I just think that's cute, but highly recommend not sponsored, but get it. It, it works. I love it.